This year, the biggest thing is going to be uh, that we're going to have a scheduled storm removal service in our residential areas. This new policy allows us to get through most of our neighborhoods in five days. We're hoping to get 90% done in five days. We get a dedicated equipment that go into residential areas and that are assigned to residential areas and it'll allow for us to have more frequent and a more efficient and a scheduled service in our residential areas. We'll be able to go through neighborhoods at a high rate and so we hope to provide a high level of service. The, the way the policy is set up is that we get a major snow event that service will begin within 24 hours of that event or if we get an accumulation of snow over several events, uh, once that accumulation gets to uh, 10 centimeters, which is about four inches, that triggers us to commence our program. We'll put notifications out through our website and through our Facebook page. The way our program is gonna work, we're gonna follow the Aquaterra garbage pickup schedule. Uh, so they're on a five day schedule, so that uh, your regular garbage day pickup day is on a Wednesday. We're gonna be in there the day before uh, cleaning the snow out of your neighborhood. Uh, so it gives you a little bit of a heads up about when we're going to be in your neighborhood. It's going to give you uh, time to remove your vehicle from the road. One of the biggest obstacles that uh, our crews have is parked vehicles and getting the job done quickly and efficiently is all about getting vehicles off the road. It not only increases the level of difficulty for the operators going around a vehicle and not damaging a vehicle, it also decreases the speed we can go if we have to navigate around parked vehicles decreases the quality that we give because once the vehicle leaves there will be a nasty little mound of snow that will stay there until we come back again. If they see the equipment working in their neighborhood and if they can possibly take another route that benefits everybody because we don't have to stop and make openings for residents to get through a snow pile. It makes it nicer for your neighbors when they come drive back down the street. The goal is to uh, have all of our neighborhoods in Grand Prairie cleared within five days, but there's going to be things come up that, uh, whether it's equipment issues or heavy accumulations of snow, it may cause us to have to come back the next week to do it. Our standard for service in our residential areas is to have all our residential areas done within a two-week period. Two main ways that you can help us with our program this year. This new way, what we're doing, we're splitting the snow in the middle of the road, uh, pushing to the side of the road. There will be windrows at the ends of each driveway. You know, the plan is to keep those windrows to a very minimal height. The city recognizes the fact that there's some homeowners who are unable for various reasons to, to remove the windrow from the end of the driveway. We do have a program called our Windrow Clearing Program that will address these situations and we have more details on that program that will be available shortly. For the most part, when you get a normal winter, uh, we get a dump of snow, we're going to be starting our residential program within 24 hours. But extreme situations, it may take longer than a 24-hour period to get into our residential neighborhoods, but the standard is the 24 hours. Lots more information. You want to check our website at www.cityofgp.com.